Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day it may be for you. I am the Layback Gamer, and we're back with Ratchet and Clank going commando. Oh, I've been waiting for this game for a while. As you can see, well, me and my brother, we uh, we did a few playthroughs on it on our own time. Uh, let's see, I think I'm free to go ahead and overwrite that bottom one. Welcome back to Behind the Hero. Tonight's heroes are the duo who recently restored peace and order to our galaxy. Ratchet and Clank. So, gentlemen, tell us about your latest incredible adventures. Well, as you can imagine, we've been pretty busy. After Drek's defeat, there were parades, press conferences, fancy dress balls, and the wiener roast at Al's. Oh, yeah, that. And then things started to slow down a bit. After that, we, well... There was the grand opening at Groovy Lou. Right. I think that was last week. Six months ago. We're still pretty busy, but in a more, uh, domestic sense. Yesterday, I flushed out my radiator core. I guess... No one needs a hero right now. How wrong you are, Ratchet. Mr. Lubbottom, I found our man. Welcome. What the? I'm Abercrombie Fizzwich, founder of the Megacorp Company in the Bogon Galaxy. Bogon? I'm sorry to incapacitate you. But our entire galaxy is in a very precocious situation. I must humbly request your sustenance on a mission of dire urgitude, a mission of superfluous peril, a mission of unequivocal imperitude. Did that make any sense? So, you need me to go on a dangerous mission in another galaxy. Indubitably. A few days ago, this top secret biological experiment was stolen from our testing laboratory by this dude. Criminal mastermind, and I need you to get the experiment back. We'll do it. We will. Frank, I have precipitated your recalcitrance and have made special improvisations for you. We are prepared to give you a job as the head accountant for Megacorp, plus a penthouse suite in lovely Megapolis, and our state of the art robotic masseuse. Deal. As for you, Ratchet, now I need you on some purgatory shape. While in transit to the Pokemon Galaxy, you will undergo heavy training and conditioning, including martial arts, heavy weaponry, survival skills, stealth, macrame, ballroom dance, and origami. We used bipolar vector regurgitation to track the thief's location to a flying base in Sector 7. It will tribulate the base and the tree the experiment. Sir, ready for launch. So yeah, if you haven't figured it out, we, well, are playing Ratchet and Clank Going Commando, the second installation of the Ratchet and Clank original series. Ratchet reporting. I'm on final approach to coordinates 37 Alpha. Good luck. I'm counting on you. Affirmative. Beginning radio silence. And of course, my all-time favorite Ratchet and Clank. I'm very excited. Now... I have come up with a couple of challenges for this one, and I think they are pretty de. I think they. I think they're okay. Uh, challenge one is that, well, of course, a hundred percent completion. Challenge two, less than thirty hours on this game. Uh, the next challenge that I've installed is called. Oh, what did I call it again? Oh, I'm not remembering the name. Oh, come on, brain. Think of the name. Oh, yeah. Fa I, call, I remember. I call it favoritism. So, basically, I have to upgrade... it. Basically, in the, the, this game in introduces upgradable weapons that you can purchase. Or, or not purchase. Uh, that You purchase the weapon, and they'll upgrade as you use it over time. Now, that means that and I'm going to have to be a little selective when I pick out my weapons... And this will get a little bit easier in challenge mode, I hope. Well, some of it will get easier, some of it will still be pretty hard. But, essentially, we start with two weapons in this game, and while I can use one or the other, or an already upgraded weapon, I cannot, use, I cannot buy any more new ones, can't 
say about anything. And then the second one is, well, as the title suggests, Going Commando. So as you, there's, there's also armor that's been introduced in this game. As the title may a hint at, I'm not allowed to equip any new pieces of armor, which means I'm going to end up saving up quite a lot of bolts just because I'm not buying weapon it's as often. I don't have... I'm not getting armor. Uh, when New Game Plus rolls around, that chat that is uh, gone. I can I can purchase new armor, but what I'm likely going to do is I'm going to save the bolts up for the second tier of upgrade because what you can get you can purchase is the weapons upgrade them one level, and then in New Game Plus you can upgrade them a second level if you purchase. Uh, the same we weapon just as an upgraded version, and basically what it does is some weapons it deals more increased damage, some uh, get, I think some get an increased rate of, rate of fire, I'm not sure if that's true, and uh, others get more ammunition to play around with. So, this is pretty exciting. This game also introduced quite a few weapons that are very iconic, including the Bouncer, which appears in the third game, and it also appears in the new re-release, which, I'll be honest, I didn't like at all. I don't like that. I don't like the PS4 version of Ratchet & Clank. But here we are. Uh, let's see here. Alright. I can live with... No, I can't live with this. Alright, let's uh, change the controls. I meant camera. Alright. And there we go. All right, so a couple of new features that we have. Uh, now, if you hold L2 or R2, you can strafe. And it makes sense with uh, the gameplay here. Ratchet's now a trained commando. So he, therefore, well, can do some of the things that he couldn't do in the first game. And in select weapons, hold triangle and select an icon. including the ability to... to Pause the game whenever you enter the quick select. So, we start off with the Lancer and the Gravity Bomb. Once I upgrade both of these, I can purchase two new weapons. But until I upgrade, or when I upgrade one, I can purchase a new weapon. If I upgrade them both, I can purchase two new weapons. But until that time, we're not going to be purchasing anything new. Press circle to fire your Lancer. So, I, I can buy ammo now from vendors. Which, I'm not sure if I'm going to. I'm going to try to not do it as much as I can. But just know that I can't, in this playthrough, I can now buy ammunition. As well as, I don't have to bank up all my bolts for the Rhino. Though, I'll be honest, it's inevitably probably going to happen. Just by the nature of uh, the favoritism challenge. Uh, oh. Camera. Okay, hold on. I gotta invert this one too. I thought I could live with the uh, left right, but apparently I can't. Which is unfortunate. Uh, challenge mode also introduces a. Well, I'm not gonna spoil it. I've already spoiled a little bit too much on challenge mode. That's likely gonna stay the, the same for a while. you and stop missing please um i'm not running any challenges for dying so if i accidentally die um there's no penalty in that there is pen however with the lack of armor it is going to get a little more a little bit difficult Try using the gravity bomb against those enemies. got him All right, oh, let's view our mission objectives. Right now we have to infiltrate the base and capture and retrieve the stolen experiment, which is a very pinnacle point in this game. A lot surprisingly, oh, look at that. That was easy, mission accomplished. Well, looks like we can all go home now. I see it's time to update my security forces. Whoa, no, hey, no, no, look, I'm just here to fix the 
Transflexor coil. Nice try. Give my regards to Mega Corp. Finish him. You wish! If a Ratchet & Clank game ever gets that easy, which, spoilers for the fourth game, for the PS4 version, I think it does. Um... Yeah. Yeah, I, I've said enough on it. I really don't like the PS4 version. Let's go. Oh, look at all of those robotic parts. Oh, double tap and triangle will switch weapons. I'm not sure if that did that in the first game, but that's now something you can easily do here. So many cutscenes, and we're only on the first planet. Well... Let's keep going. Don't need any help. Ah. Feels good to be playing this game. There's there's also a ton of new feet. Well, not a ton. Just quite a... Quite a... I'm not sure the, the descriptive word to describe it, but there's there's a lot of features. Oops. Aim your Lancer more accurately by holding L. Ah, I'm just going to storm the room. These guys are really not that active right now. Alright. Now the new mission objective is just to escape. And I didn't really show this off too much in the first game, mainly because the there was no uh, mission objectives underneath. But the one thing that they added in this game that I wish they kept for the other Ratchet & Clank games was if you come down to... No, it was option... Help? They'll actually tell you a little bit about the monsters, some hints, their statistics. And, well, here we are. Have I really killed that many? Huh. I guess I did. That's strange. Oh well. I'm just I'm very happy to be playing this game. It's a it's an all-time favorite for me. Pull out the gravity bomb, come up here. I almost bit the bullet. <gasps> you do not get to do that! No hitting me! Yeah, you don't need to go after him. Who needs to go after him? I don't. Ratchet checking in, sir. Incredulous. I didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, so soon. There was a slight problem. The thief escaped with the experiment, and I have no idea where he was headed. Not to worry. I just received an omission which may lubricate the matter. Do you have any maps for this quadrant of the galaxy? You bet, mister! We got galactic maps, 3D maps, foldouts, cutouts, maps to the stars, and their homes! Sorry about that. Oh, I forgot my wallet. Could you take care of this? I'm on my way. So yeah, as you can see, um, well, it looks like our new bad guy is already getting in. It's already doing a couple bad things right at the moment. No good for us. And let us go. 
So, new new world, nice swampy area. I'm not even going to be touching the Mega Corp vendor. So, a uh, little bit of backstory. Get essentially, we're since we're in a new galaxy, there's a new, uh, I guess, security a security corporation here, and Mega Corp is. Well, that happens to be that. Gadgetron was the security weapons, I guess, dealer in the previous game, and Megacorp is the one in this one. Which one do I like better? Uh, I would say I like actually both of them pretty equally. I don't need to throw my wrench. Who needs to throw the wrench? I don't. Alright, but I will be kicking off this planet, and this will be the last planet I do. Hey, look, there's there's that guy from the mall. Hey, sir, can we help you out? Well, now that's just rude. You're not allowed to disappear. Don't disappear on me, good sir. Alright, let's keep going. Oop, don't... Oh, bad. Yes, I hear your pleas. Don't worry, here, let me help you, sir. My nanotech upgrade vaporized him! No, it actually didn't. Alright, let's keep going. Hop across the... Oh, the disgust... The disgusting swamp mo swamp mo Oh. I forgot, you, if you knock enemies into this, you actually kill them, and you get three hops in this. I missed. Oh, no. No matter. We are going to get a weapon upgrade soon. Um... Now, the first bit, little bit of the game, we might end up accidentally wasting some uh, XP. Um, but afterwards, there shouldn't be any uh, XP waste at all. Uh, there are some weapons in this game, such as there is a Rhino for this game, uh, that you uh, can't up that won't be able to be upgraded. So those weapons, I will purchase and I'm allowed to use them. And we will need them later in the game. I'm not uh, once again like the last game. I'm not going to disable messages. I actually quite enjoy having them here. No scope. Look at, look at all these fancy jumps. Couldn't do that in the first game, could ya? And... Sh I was about to say... Uh, I don't know what I was about to say. I kind of lost track of what I was going to say there. I haven't died yet. That's a good start for me. Normally I die at about this part. Hey, look at that giant tentacle. I wonder what it is. Oh, it multiplied. Oh, uh... Haha, <laughs> missed. So this is a very simple early mini boss. Ooh, uh, although I am getting beaten up, I realize that. Oh, uh, please stop beating me up. The other tentacle now, but don't need to worry. And I'll be up in a second. Or back, or not up, I'll be back in one second. Okay, sorry about that. Quick pause there. I had to go quick take care of something. But let's get back to this. So, again, very simple boss. As long as you can stay out of the range of the tentacles, uh, you'll be fine. Don't, don't drown right now, please. Also, don't take any more hits until we upgrade our health. So that's another way to get health back, because when you upgrade your nanotech, you instantly gain all your health back. As well as vaporize every enemy in the area, thus killing them. I kind of wish that wasn't the case. 
But unfortunately, that is. Thank you. Thank you, game. All right, gadgets also don't count as. Well, they don't upgrade. Alright, now we will be back on this planet a little bit later for our titanium bolts and skill... They are titanium bolts in this game, not gold bolts. So we will be back on this planet for that. There's also a couple extra features on this planet that we'll need to come back for. This game is perhaps one of the harder ones to get all for me to get all the skill points. I've only ever done it once. And that was well in the... Thank you for telling me that. Oops. Alright, let's just do that. No. Bad up. Hey. You're not allowed to hit me. Now don't worry, we're going to get the first upgrade it. We're going to upgrade our Lancer within the level. We won't have to go to the next level in order to do that. As we still have a whole other section left to go. And you may have noticed, but we don't have Clank. Don't worry. We'll, uh, we'll acquire him. Well, maybe we might not. We will see. But I'm sure we haven't seen the last of Clank yet. Oh, uh, I keep... <laughs> I tried to... I tried to activate the helipack. Alright, so, I just want you guys... I'm gonna come over here and break a couple of boxes down. Uh, remember this here. Just remember this for later. Remember this. Alright, now we have a bit of a, uh... I don't know what this I would call this. Just hop over a bunch of stuff is what I would call it, and we did it. Patrick, come in. Are you there? Copy, Mr. Fizzwidget. Listen, I have some new information on our experiments wherewithal. The thief was indemnified at Megacorp's Maktar Resort. Also, the thugs have towed a moon-sized jamming array into Maktar Resort orbit. Should I take it out? A formulas! It's discombobulating our annual Galactic Gladiators broadcast. See for yourself. Ask yourself, are you man enough, hero enough, insane enough to step into the ring with two of the fiercest warriors in the galaxy? If you answered yes, you're a big, fat liar. But that's okay, because Megacorp is bringing Galactic Gladiators into your home for a special Mega View event. First, it's survival of the fittest in our bio competition. Be there as Chainblade. Chainblade unleashes his fury on our gladiator guest contestants. Chainblade has gone undefeated in 500 straight matches. But if the bio division doesn't do it for you, our robotics division will. Taste the adrenaline as contestants face off against our four armed bandit, the B2 Brawler. 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 No living creature is a match for this machine. Watch six tons of carbonox alloy hunt for his prey. There's no consolation prize, because this bad boy's program has shown no mercy. So, what are you waiting for? Call now to bring Chain Blade and the P2 Brawler into your living room. But put away the fine china. <laughs> the Galactic Gladiators, only on Mega View. Call your provider now. Chain Blade, huh? I've got the coordinates. Ratchet out. All right, so thank you for that. Uh, yes, I'm happy to hear that. So we now can go to a new area, but we're not quite done here yet. Still available, press select or R3 to access your map, then press X to open the mission screen. As we still have this area here. Alright, let's see how well I can shoot. Wow, apparently not very well. Oh, oh I got I'm decent. First first try. Oh. 
Uh, you okay there? Here, let me help you. All right, let's just keep going. And just, oh, we're about to upgrade. This is awesome. Say goodbye to the Lancer and say goodbye to the Lancer. No! I didn't get to see the animation! But we got the heavy, we now have the heavy Lancer. Which is a more powerful version of the Lancer. Sorry for hitting you. I was just very excited and also a little frustrated that I didn't quite get to see the animation. Uh, we will not be upgrading the gravity gun, the gravity bomb, this level. But we will be upgrading it in the next. So let's make some money shots. Come everybody over here. Not quite the money shot I was looking for. That's the money shot. So we got a little bit left of this level to go. I'm hoping I can find a few more ammo crates. I really should be picking up every bolt that I can. I also really should be destroying everything, but we'll, uh, we'll find a better way to destroy stuff as the game progresses. <sighs> One thing that I didn't like that the remasters did, or not the remaster, uh, the, uh, that when they re released it on the PS3, uh, a lot of the helmets I found just did not want to fit on their characters' heads. Well, at least Ratchet's in particular. It, they, it just did not want to fit on his head. I'm going to try to get everything here. Which means i got to wait a second. He's going to turn around. Surprise! And I'm just going to whack you with the wrench. Uh, can you take me right next to the... Alright, these camera controls are getting... Don't miss the jump. Okay, good. Whew, that was a close one. That one would take me all the way over there. I don't want to go there. I actually want to take you and... Surprise! Come here. Another gravity bomb gun ammo. Alright. Can I get... Can I get all of you in a nice, straight line? Can I get all of you together? Good enough. And I'll vaporize the other two. Uh, did it get the one? No, it didn't. He was behind a wall. How many did I get? Oh, uh, let's see. Alright, I believe that's all the enemies in this level. So I will have to refill, but I'm probably not going to, especially since I know the next place we're going to, I may be able to get some, uh, well, we're going to get a skill point there. First, of course, we have to get off of this world. And you'll see how we can get a skill point. I'll, sh I'll tell you guys in the next episode. But this episode is going to be coming to a close, so let me know in the comments section if you're hyped to see Ratchet and Clank. Or at least the second one. As a kid, I always tried to get to see... I always tried to see if I could get them all to activate at once. I could never do that, and I still can't to this day. And what's this guy got? Welcome, welcome. Uh, if everyone could take their seats, we can proceed with today's demonstration. First... I'll need a volunteer. Anyone? Excellent. Your name, sir? Ratchet. <laughs> and there you have it. The Megacorp Tractor Beam in action. Let's give it up for our volunteer. Sir, how about taking advantage of our show special? Deal. Thank you, sir. You won't be disappointed. The tractor beam moves small and medium-sized objects which have glowing orange targets like these. Press circle to move those columns so you can scale the cliff. Alright, very good. Very good. 
So, before we leave this world, let's get let's grab our first platinum bolts or titanium bolts. So, I think they're no, they're platinum in this game, not titanium. So, uh, the game actually wants you to go over that way, which therefore you would miss this obvious other place over here that ho hosts our first platinum. Yeah, it's platinum. Yeah, it is platinum, not titanium. Sorry, titanium is the next game. But here is our first platinum vault of the game. Uh, there are, I believe, a total of two skill points that are associated with this place. I know all of them. And if I'm forgetting one, uh, I will definitely look it up. But I have gotten all of them at one point in time. And, well, yeah, I think the tractor beam is a pretty decent object. Uh, unfortunately, this is the only game that will ever see such a... Uh, it's an interesting item. It definitely makes for a bit of fun platforming when you can now move the platforms around. And with that, we are now back at the beginning of the level. Uh, help desk? Nope. But essentially, all missions are complete on this world. We can now head to the next world. But that will be in the next video, of course. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed. Don't forget to share this video or any of my other videos to anyone who you think will enjoy my content. Next time, we'll be taking a look at Maktar Resort, as well as the moon-sized jamming array that was tugged into Maktar Resort orbit, so I guess technically two planets in one? Although, I'd say one and a half. One and a half. But, until next time, guys, take it easy.